Hey everybody, did you know that praying to your body and asking it forgiveness can heal you? Yeah, me neither, but today we will learn something new. Or maybe not. And make sure you watch this until the end because it just gets stranger as it goes on and you'll see the spirit of Heidi Baker emerge several times along with so-called tongues right up till the last clip. I was sitting in a financial sozo with my husband. Houston, we have a problem. And uh, he was sozoing a young man. And we were just about done. And I was taking notes because I was the second and he was he was taking care of the guy and i heard this ah! and i look up i'm like whoa, 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 what's going on and my husband's just talking and going through and i'm thinking maybe i made this up and i, I just keep writing and i hear this ah! i mean like i hear this, this this guy is screaming at me and i look up my husband's just you know going and i'm thinking what is wrong with me I'm thinking, well, maybe it's outside and nobody's hearing it. And so I just keep writing. And for the last time I hear, ah! And I'm like, what is going on? I could swear this guy is screaming at me. And so Steve finishes and he says, honey, do you have anything? And I said, is it possible that your body is mad at you? Remember this? My husband's eyes are like this big around. He's like, what weird thing is my wife about to do? <laughs> this is a financial sozo lady right? <laughs> and he said, oh yeah, this guy says, oh yeah, my body's been screaming at me for the last 10 minutes. I'm like, yeah, I hear it. <laughs> screaming. So let me get this right. She's actually heard an audible voice screaming and it was somebody's body, a body that had a voice of its own and everybody just sits there and listens to her. I think sometimes we are locked in a prison of unforgiveness because our bodies are mad at us or we are mad at our bodies. Because unforgiveness works the same way whether it's someone else you're mad at or someone or you being mad at you. And think about we are body, soul, and spirit. Is it not possible that may, just maybe your body is really frustrated with you because you've not been taking care of it? Maybe your body's mad at you and your body's like, yeah, no, we're not going to get healed because if you get healed, you're just going to wear me out again. How many bodies are screaming at us all the time? It's called pain. It's called sickness. It's called disease. So close your eyes. Say, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. Is my body mad at me? If you heard yes, stand up. Because sometimes it's a soul issue. Whoa. What was that? I have seen so many people healed when they've been prayed for and prayed for and prayed for when they release this prayer. So here she's going to give you a prayer to pray to your body, not to God. And I know it sounds weird, but just do this. Say, body, body. I ask you to forgive me. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. Wow! Whoa! 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 For any way, I have mistreated you. For any way. I have let you down, ignored you, and made you scream louder. I say to the just buck up spirit. <laughs> Whoa, yeah, 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 yeah. The just buck up spirit? 
Well, that's a new one. Okay, seriously, this is not the Holy Spirit. Why can't people see this? I'm done partnering with you. You have harmed my body, and I command you off of me. So apparently this just buck up spirit is a real spirit, even though you could see she was just making it up on the spot and laughing at herself because even she knew it was so ridiculous. And we can partner up with this spirit against ourselves, but then decide later to break that partnership. This is so far-fetched that even Kenneth Copeland would be rebuking her. I say to the just buck up spirit, <laughs> Whoa, yeah, 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 yeah. Body, will you forgive me? <sighs> How many of you heard yes? yes. <laughs> yeah, so say body. As you forgive me, let's step out of prison and into the possibilities of healing. If you heard yes, sit down. If you didn't hear yes, or you, sometimes we don't hear it. Sometimes we just know the relief. Oh, then that's a yes. Your body's like, it's about friggin' time. <laughs> that's a word my kids use. Okay. All right. So if you, if you didn't hear that, so, so when you're standing, just, just say this. Say, body, why are you mad at me? And body. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Why do you want to scream at me? And have a conversation with your body. Okay, seriously, this is just bonkers. We have special places that people go to that actually speak to their bodies, especially ones that hear them talk back. Reconcile with why it's mad at you. And then ask your body to forgive you. And watch as it repositions you into a place of a possibility in God. Okay, have a seat. So there you have it, folks. The next time you hear your body screaming at you, just remember that prayer. And if you did find this video helpful or at least amusing, make sure to like and share it. And until next time, take care and God bless.